What's up, Pyromaniacs? Pyrostasis here, and uh, I'm attempting to play with only one thumb today. We are back on the uh, the Pacifist slash Conjurer. We are in the College of Winterhold in the, uh, I don't know, I guess you'd call this the dormitory. And we are on the second floor. In there right here is a guy you can talk to, and he will sell you some rather rare ingredients. One of the key ingredients that you want from him is the Daedra Heart. Now, this character doesn't have very high uh, skills in, um, what do you call it, bartering, etc. So he charges me through the nose, but you can get that relatively cheap. Uh, you just basically come up here when it's late at night. Uh, if there's nobody here, wait an hour and they'll all pop up. Now, I've got the Daedra Heart and a few other ingredients. Uh, some of the other rooms in here, if you look around, you can find all sorts of nice stuff. Uh, I found the void salts and such that I need for the Storm Atronach right here. Uh, and, you know, you can pretty much find just all the ingredients that you need for the different spells at the forge. So we're going to head on over to the forge as soon as I can figure my way out of here and uh, see if we can't make some of the spells that you guys have been asking me to utilize. All right, so once you decide that you want to make some spells in the Achenok Forge, what you want to do is come over here. We are at the College of Winterhold. This is the main entrance. It's off a little bit to the left. I'm quite sure where he's going. But you're looking for the Midden right over here. Uh, if you complete the quest line for the College of Winterhold, I do believe you eventually go down here and talk to someone or something. But uh, we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves there. So you want to head down in here. There's a couple different places you can go but just walk down here take a right or whoops no yeah right here sorry about that and back up here you will find a few monsters in here so you want to be careful with uh with how you get down here and there's some nice little uh, materials and such that you can get down in here. But this is the Atronox Forge, and I'm going to show you guys how to use that here shortly. All right, so this is the Atronox Forge. Uh, to utilize this thing, you've got a couple different options here. You've got the box, you've got this pillar, and then you've got the pedestal. Now, uh, there's two different types of things you can do here. You can make books, scrolls, staffs, etc., and you can actually summon Atronox in their raw state and they will whoop your ass. So I don't know what the point of uh, doing actual summoned uh, Atronox is, but I'm sure there's a point. All right, so we're going to be making the Storm Atronox. Now, to do this, we need a few ingredients. One of them is a death belt, which you can get from the Palace in Solitude. Uh, the other one is a Mammoth Tusk, which you can get in Jorvasker. If you take a left instead of a right, uh, when you go inside there, it's inside the little room and you can't really miss it. All right, so it's those two things. We need a void salt and a ruined book. And we only need one of those. Scroll it back. Come on. There we go. Now that we've put all of these things in the offering box, which you can see right here, you pop this little switch here. And there's our book. And we hop over here. Conjure Storm Atronach. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Now there's a couple different uh, spells you can get. You can make staffs here. You can make scrolls. Uh, but I do believe this is the best one that we can make uh, at this location. Now I'm going to go see if we can get the Daedra Lord. Alright, to get the Demora Lord, you have to have 65 conjuration uh, according to the wiki i'm going to verify that now i did have to go out and uh, soul tap hump a couple corpses but uh thankfully i now have 65 conjuration and the dude you're looking for is a creepy little guy who likes to hang out in this room here i don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. oh where is a little right bastard here. He's always hanging out around here. Last time I saw him, he was right over here. Where is the dude? Right, we're going to wait an hour and see if he shows up. He may only show up. There he is. Spells and incantations for those. And click here. And it is not showing up. 
Dead zombie. Expel Daedra. Ooh. There it is. Demora Lord. $2,200. Holy shit. Alright, let's see if I've got anything this guy is even remotely interested in. And it doesn't look... Well, wait. He might want these. Well, I don't really have to make all that much, honestly. That should be quite enough. Alright. Finis Guster. Let's click on books. And... Conjure Demora Lord. Holy crap. Boom. There we go. Let's go to items, books. There we go. Until next time. And I don't know if I have enough mana to summon this bad boy. 241. Ooh. Not ch oh, just barely. Boom. What's up, dude? How you doing, buddy? Check out that sword. That sword right there is what we call a weapon of mass destruction. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright, so, last episode I believe it was, we got our ass handed to us by some arrogant fucking little bastard in a dungeon who kept turning my summons. The benefit of the Demora Lord is supposedly they are unturnable. So we are going to head back off over here. If I can remember which one of these places it was. Oh, son of a bitch. Don't tell me I'm going to forget. Rangval. There we go. And we've got a date with a very, well, hopefully soon, a very unhappy dragon priest. Alright, is he still with me? No, I didn't think so. The summon only lasts a short time. Now, um, the nice thing about this spell is it doesn't require any perks. Obviously, the more perks you have, especially the elite spell casting uh, mana cost reduction, will definitely make it easier to get this bad boy off. So I'm going to go ahead and save. And I am hoping this dude... Wait. There we go. I am hoping this dude whoops some ass. Because it is going to be quite disconcerting if he is not capable of killing this dragon priest. Because this really is pretty much the creme de la creme of summons. I mean, it, it really doesn't get much better than this. Alright, where are you, you little bitch? Go. Wait till this big bad boy gets opened up. Come on. Wow. Say hello to my little friend. Oh snap. Oh God, I hope he can hold up against Jesus. Holy shit. Oh, dude, that Demora Lord is raping. Okay, Demora, stop blocking and rape. That's right, buddy. God, those Storm Atronox are badass. He four-shot him. All right, now take out Odar the Mad. Dude, and I bet with the top-end perk that allows me to summon two, I can have two of these bad boys. Oh. That is quite possibly the only thing on the planet that is better than two hot Asian twins. Oh, oh. I, oh, Jesus! Alright, Odar. I was just playing. You know, we got off the wrong start. Come on, man. Come on. Don't let... No, no. Bad Odar. Bad Otar. No. G God. I've got to get that perk. There we go, there we go, there we go. Woo! Alright, go whoop his ass. That's what... Damn, dude! That electricity is badass, man. I would not. Will you, will you please finish him? Wh why are you just standing there? You have a big two-handed sword. Would you please use it? What the... What the... Well, that usually implies you're actually fucking attacking, you useless piece of shit. Alright, so something is wrong with the Demora. 
Do I have any magic potions? No. Fuck. He's not mortal. He's a fucking dragon priest. Oh, man. I had to get, like, the one retarded Demora Lord, don't I? That's fine. I'm gonna wait on my mana. Only thing I can think of is maybe because of where the dragon's priest or dragon priest is located, that he's maybe out of the. I fuck. I don't know. This is just broken. Let's see. Where is my ability? All right. So I've got highborn up. I will feast on your heart by standing in front of you and looking scary. It's like, bro, that is not an effective way to kill someone. Trust me. Alright, let's move him. There we Whoa! Okay, is he is he hitting him now? Yes! Go! Rape him! Alright. Good, 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 good. Damn, dude! Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and blow this on the off chance that my little Demora does not finish off the Dragon Priest. Which is quite possible. It's like Darth Vader fighting the Emperor, man. Look at all that lightning. Oh, shit! Finish him! Finish him! Oh, I love you! Alright, what do we have here? Search Ash Pile. Staff of Stormwall and Otar. Resistance against fire, frost, and shock is improved. Really? That's it. <laughs> He's all like, shit, that was nothing, man. If I didn't think you'd bite me, I'd hug you. Alright, we're gonna go and get what's on this wall over here. Hopefully it's something awesome. Word of power learned, Kine, Kine's peace. What the hell is Kine's peace? Kind's peace. The voice sees wild beasts, lose their desire to fight, and flee. Eh, that's kind of cool. Now, there is always an awesome chest around dragon priests. Okay, well, maybe this one's not going to be awesome. It's just going to be kind of ghetto. And really, that's it. There's no, like, awesome chest or some shit. Dead Draugr over here. Oh! <laughs> right here in front of my fucking blind ass face. There we go. Uh, it's not Staff of Zombies. I wonder if that will count towards my normal summons. That would be kind of cool. Anyways, revenge has been enacted. I have uh, slain Otar the Mad and reestablished dominance. I'm feeling pretty good about myself. So I think the uh, the little conjurer is going to become uh, pretty hard to fuck with from here on. We shall see. Especially once I get two of those bad boys, it's it's pretty much game over. So let me know what you guys are thinking about this series and what you're thinking about the uh, changes to the character. Oh, I also got the fra or the uh, the electrical Atronach whose name I can't remember. Storm Atronach. I got him as well. So we'll have to test him out because. He looked pretty badass. I mean, on, honestly, he's nowhere near as cool as the uh, the Demora Lord, but it might be cool to have one Storm Atronach and one Demora Lord just for shits and giggles. So, hope you guys are liking this series. If you do, please click that like button. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my other videos, tips, tricks, and guides. And I'll catch you guys in the next clip.